Apologies, everyone. I was just setting up everyone's uh, tokens. Um, we are getting ready to start. We're going to be starting right now, actually. And here we go. Unsure. Hello. Blind, deaf, and paralysis, 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 or poison conditions I can cure. Hello. Hmm. Otherwise, I'm going to take a uh, silence or something. Sure. You guys are on death end now. Yeah, no. Uh, silence is useful against spellcasters, but I don't know what it would do. How are we all doing today? Good. Surviving. I'm, I'm lagging. Cool. So, pretty good. <laughs> do you want to use Bless? I don't think I need oh, I'll, I'll use Bless. I'll use Bless. I'll try yeah, it again. Bless is cool. <laughs> I got Blitz, Guiding uh, Bolts, <laughs> Healing Word, Shield of Faith, Warding Bond, Spiritual Weapon, Lesser Restoration. I think I get one more. Everyone's volume. Cool, cool, cool. I don't I have Cure Wounds, muted. by the way. Finny, I think okay. your mic was bugging out. Can you can you speak? Hello? Oh, there you go. Okay, cool, cool. Okay. Uh, I, I just heard it staticky, but I guess I was hearing things. Oh, okay. Um, I'm also okay. not on the correct map currently. Yep, yep, yep. I'll get you. I'll get everyone set up. Uh, we're going right, to. Sounds good. Uh, we like to see how. I'll get silence. Let's try it. Pass. All right, you should be able to move on to the Iron Hole map, which is where we are. Okay. So, hello. Let me let me turn off this lo-fi here. Okay. There we go. Lo-fi is off. So, welcome to session 11 of the founding of Ironhole. Does anyone remember what happened last time? And would like to give a recap? I mean, I could. I could also give a recap, but I want to test your guys' intelligence. Test your guys' uh, memory. I'll, I'll go this time then. Okay. So, last I remember, we took on the large, um, the, the large bastion knoll thing, and then Alexandros came in, saved our asses, and then we had a t long talk with Giano about everything, and then, uh, Montmorency, uh, found out that we needed to go and save her. Save her from what exactly? Save me from the nothing. Um, from that, that kind of like save her Kalashtar part of her type mm -hmm. deal. Okay. F from what I gathered from it, Kalashtars are weird. Indeed, indeed. So. Close enough. Pretty good, pretty good start. Let me just get some ambience for you guys. Are we going to be listening to metal music this fight? Yes. Perhaps. Yes. yes. So. Different hair? We're going to take Shank Sanctuary. Where we, last, where we last we're left time? our adventurers. The party encountered the Bastion of Hunger. The once Bastion member from Ironhole who was converted into this fiendish, knollish creature from the pits of maddening hunger within the within the Knoll camp. The party fought the Bastion of Hunger. It was a long-winded fight. However, the party eventually came out on top. And no, nothing bad happens. Nothing bad happens to the founders. Now to Ironhole? Yes. Something bad can happen to it, but to the founders, we are. However, the Bastion of Hunger fell inside of the Amber Shrine. And when that happened, the Bastion of Hunger began to switch and shift as the as the being inside the Amber Shrine itself began to subtly change its morphology. And it became a humanoid again. However, this time with two large amber great axes and a large creature that it was riding upon. Alexandros quickly knowing that something was in trouble, came over to you guys and said he would deal with it. 
And where we began our session, the party began in the council room, where they were talking with Giano about their next steps. They were given a reward of a thousand gold and some goodies that they got, a nice bow for Lycus and a focus for Karenin and a pendant for Diamond. They also had a deep philosophical talk about Mon Morrency and her connection to the Crimson Phoenix. Giano expressed his concerns with the Phoenix's control over her and began to plant the seeds of self-doubt within Montmorency, further, further pushed by Meryl and her deceptive nature. You're welcome. <laughs> However, as she began to question the Lord of Fire, he seemingly snapped. She was sent to the... She was sent to the Dream Realm interacted with the split dreamers for the first time that she remembers and the lord of fire appeared and attempted to attack her severing her amber power and officially waged war upon the amber crown and as we begin our session the party hold up before this i, mm -hmm. I wanted to snitch okay the, the lord of fire to turn on can i do that sure you can snitch what do you say? Why are you snitching? <laughs> what? I want to snitch Cause too. Because I have to. <laughs> okay. Like, I, I was told the Lord of Fire was her enemy and still is, but he's a you colleague. Know you know I'm going to snitch too. Why not? All of all going to snitch. I'm going to snitch. Man, we got a bunch of fucking... We got a bunch of fucking saying? snitches in chat, man. <laughs> That's the thing, man. Snitching in the Lord of Fire. No, 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 no. Snitching in a snitching is a cruel and horrible word. The better term is, um... Telefalent. No, 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 no. It's we're informing, not tattletaling, not snitching. We're just letting them know in advance. Okay. There's one time I actually do agree with you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. They're snitching on the Lord of Fire. Snitching. Dude. We're not snitching. <laughs> we're snitches get stitches. We're 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 my God. <laughs> so you all, you all snitch to your gods. What do you yes. say? In, what do you say in particular? Hmm. Can I snitch to the Lord of Fire and call him a meanie? <laughs> Lord of Fire. <laughs> no. Diamond, I think you. I'm here Lord of Fire. I think your bitch. mic is staticking a little bit. Yeah, it sounds. Oh like, no! Hang on. It sounds like a coming. <laughs> okay. I'm here to announce the Lord of Fire is a bitch mother. <laughs> I am here to announce that the Lord of Fire is a bitch ass motherfucker. <laughs> To the Lord of Fire himself. He said his wings oh, are this big. Oh, it's disgusting. Great. <laughs> oh, great, wonderful, and lovable Tomat. I just want to let you know in advance, Lord of Fires might kill you, and it's also a bitch. Just to let you know in advance, <laughs> oh, um, if something would have happened with him, it's not my fault. I can't even commune to the exalts. <laughs> I, can't even, I can't even tell them that shit's going on. No, you can. can oh, I yeah, can't. I you no, can. I cannot. You can't. Oh, I cannot. What? Nope. I can't. Talk he sealed. He, he sealed some of the power, I believe. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yeah. I can't even use my amber. I can't remember specifically. Currently, I can't use my amber because I watched the vod. There you go. Currently, Mont, it feels like your consciousness, which was normally split in two halves, for the first time in a while, you feel quiet. It's an uneasy feeling as you've grown accustomed to the. To the sporadic talkings of the people in the exalt chat however for the first time it's eerily silent i uh, finally have to listen to that freaking salifax dude talk anymore <laughs> <laughs> hey Mark, you all right nice huh you seem different you know you look, you look clear now should i switch my Who's avatar salifax? should i switch my thing to not oh wait the, to like my original character you don't, you don't have to oh, okay that's fine you still the Ember Eye, just sealed away for now. Mm -hmm. Should I roll? Yeah, sure. Um, you don't need to roll for uh, specifically talking to your gods. It's, she, she, they will most likely respond. Um, uh, alrighty. And with that, Mont, a silverish energy begins to emanate by your feet as a portal forms in the center of town. Time is... Time is slowly coming to a halt. Give me up, Scotty. As the dream world beckons. Do I have to say the words? Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Kalistar. As the word echoes across the across the city, you see birds off in the distance get spooked by the sudden shock wave of wind as they begin flying off into the sunset. And you guys teleport to the dream realm. I'm very tired now. The manifestation of the dream realm is a bit hard for me to describe in uh in your world terms, but essentially think of these as separate memories of Mont that are flowing within the world. That they're that are feeding into this central memory that you are currently placed within. This memory is of a of of what you would come to think of as a palace room. A long violet carpet leads to a dual throne up at the top with two statues of two dream knights standing guard. Mon, I need you to make me a history check. Sure thing. History. I'm not very historical. <laughs> okay. Can I guidance that, I guess? Sure. That's, a, that's still not really that much, but... These clearly depict uh, dream knights who who protect the dream and make sure everything is okay. And you would assume this is the dual throne where you and your sister would sit, accompanying those that would um, accompanying those that would have any offers for the dream. You know, people who want to be coronated as dream knights or people who want to deal with a life that has become too reckless. As I you don't recognize who they are, right? You do not recognize them with that low roll. Okay. As you all, as you all form onto the jade green tiles, there's an eerie quietness to the area. What was once what you assumed to be a bustling palace is nothing but a blood, a bloodied, a bloodied palace room. As standing across the way is a creature with jagged black. Um, jagged black spikes that come out from its back. Almost this molten core of magma on the inside. Mont, make me another history check, this time with advantage. Okay. Is that left? Oh, left that left? looks dangerous. Oh, that's the wrong it. one. That's all right. It's 17. 17. <laughs> okay. With shift, not control. Your memories begin to, begin to formulate on this creature, and it is the creature that invaded the dream with the Lord of Fire itself. And in this little memory, your vision shifts, one from the quiet palace to a battlefield, as the Lord of Fire has erupted into the dream to take over it and weaponize the dream itself. Over here, you see the body of your sister, who has fallen unconscious from the strain of the battle. Because you two are strong, there's no doubt about that, but you're magical casters, and when that... And when that magical strain is severed, it is hard for you to continue fighting. This creature is holding another person in its hands. It's you, from the past. Wearing this regalia, this, this crimson regalia, and this, um, this golden crown across your head. As it moves over, it, it pushes you up to the pillar and repeatedly begins punching Mont's head indenting into the pillar and then just simply throws you over a top of its head as you tumble down down the carpet right by your feet man coincidentally you look is, it, is it me ever seeing two months as mont lays there almost unconscious on the breaking point of life and death the creature looks your way I shoot it. Okay. All <laughs> no, right. Don't. No words. Roll me an attack roll. <laughs> that will hit for how much point? How much uh, damage? Well, I didn't. Uh, eight plus four. Were you shooting at the dream thing or me? Uh, yes, I shoot you immediately. <laughs> the vicious of me. The vision of me. No. I was going to prepare, by the way, but you just shot. However, that time has passed. As the time for mercy is Imagine over. Imagine preparing against. Imagine a preparing against a monster. <laughs> Imagine planning out anything. Mm. Would have, would have showed I up wanted a more lore. You ruined it. <laughs> the creature you know. will. The creature will stammer forward, and utter these words. 
Good job, Catboy. Now we didn't have time to prepare. What prepare? There's only one thing you can do, and that's bless. Call Seth false life on myself, and then bless. I, I, will, I, will let, I will let you all position Thank yourself you. no farther than the halfway point in between these two pillars. I stand like a chad. Oh, I take position. Thank you. I... <laughs> I am the wall. I fight for glory. Oh my god. Will I you lose to me die. once more, Empress? She's pretty pissed. As he <laughs> says that, combat begins. I didn't get a chance to do it over. Click the button for me. <laughs> yep. Give me a moment. I'm switching up the music. Okay, just I just want to put this in chat. This is what I was going to say to my god. So if I remember what this is, would I remember any of its abilities? Uh, <laughs> you remember, you, some. you will have advantage on your first martial check. Sick. Let's go. Okay. Oh, this is good music. I need to run the bot down a little. need to roll initiative, don't I? Combat has started. Oh yeah, I need to roll initiative. He didn't start it. <laughs> okay. I need to get put on. Oh, wait for it. Man, it's garbage. Well, I forgot how to roll. All right, go to your, your go um, to your character. Right, right to your AC. Wait. Um, I'm not used to you doing that. Oh, yeah. hey, where's it again? I'm, I'm, I'm in your oh. It's right to next to your AC. It's right to the right of it. It says initiate N I A N I I N I. That is terrible. You got a seven. Let's go. Okay. Lycus, it is your turn. The creature lets out a roar that uh, that begins to emanate down, up and down the halls. Man, it would be a shame if I hit it again. I missed it. <laughs> as as you as you take a shot of your new bow, he he simply grabs the arrow and just throws it downwards. You know, if you're gonna shoot, at least hit him. I mean, I tried. Hey, I yeah, like last time, you missed so many times. Jin okay, is fine. Right. Okay, Jeez. that this one will close. that one will hit, and he has to make a dexterity saving throw. And a strength save. <laughs> if we have a boss. Oh. oh wait, no, that, that I cannot amplify that. That magically can. Dex I? save. Dear lord. Uh, save. Can I use ensnaring stank on the reaction attack? Is that a thing? Uh, so when I hit, so I had to cast it first. Hey, I did. hey guys, what, what's that little timer thing on the bottom of my screen? It's your turn timer, but yeah, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll let you do it. The game is currently paused, so we don't actually. Mm. I'll, 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 I'll let you pause on pause. I'll, pause on pause. I'll let you do it. It's... Okay, so strength save 12. Okay, that fails. He is restrained. Okay. And he takes a 1d6 piercing damage at the start of each of its turns. Even though you missed? No, second attack was reaction for the bow. Oh, the okay, bow cool. special sting. Oh, so, oh, and yeah. it takes five, 5 plus 1 plus 5, 11, 11 initial points damage. damage. Damn, dude. And uh, the 3 from the snake strike, no, the, that's 14 total. And on its turn, it, uh, it takes 1d6 piercing again. And Marshall check. Okay, you see nothing. <laughs> I, I don't even see it. Vinny, it's your turn. You're just gonna go ahead and Marshall check first. That is a success. So the creature has the following traits: ruthless and martial adept. I'll tell I'll tell you what those are. Get ready to take notes. Ruthless. This creature will attempt at all efforts to kill a down player. Most creatures, most normal creatures do not prioritize down targets, but this one is an exception. And the martial adept is this creature is adept at using martial weapons and abilities. All abilities will be a, a martial and clashes will be of the martial variety. And you can learn the following weapons. The Lord's Claws, Molten Prison, Feel the Heat, and Magma Spray. I'd like to learn... Uh... What was the heat one? Uh, or of heat or... Feel the heat? Yeah, feel the heat. 
Feel the heat. Right. Feel the heat. Oh, I'm that doesn't up. that doesn't send it. Okay. Never mind. Well, that that works for me. <laughs> good roll out the way. Let's go. What type of action? And I'm good. He heals. I'm assuming. What type? Feel of the heat. As an action, uh, summon a veil of molten magma which surrounds your body. You gain temporary hit points equal to three. Uh, that should be two d10 plus ten. You are considered resistance to all forms of non-magical damage until the start of your next turn. If the enemy does not break through your temporary hit points by the start of your next turn, you may heal yourself for two d10 plus ten. Passes and Narch has got That's a lot of healing damage. Yeah, yeah okay. All right. Um, Dub double square bars, no slash R. All right. Uh, I'm going to move here real quick. Music stop, by the way. And uh, I'm going to twin spell heroism on Mont and uh, and Thymon. Okay. Oh shit. Okay, cool. Uh, uh, modifier is five, yeah. Does this stack with false life? No. You have to choose. That does save me a spell slot. Mm -hmm. uh, your modifier is five. Time. Uh, time. Karen and God. So how much is it? Five per turn. Yes. If okay. you if you lose it, you don't gain more. It stays five. On your five turn. per turn. Yeah. Ooh. It's on the beginning of my turn, wait, though, wait. right? Mm -hmm. He's six, then, wouldn't it be? me or? Do you oh, wait, have no. a six modifier? Oh wait. Oh okay. Mm. I'm not sure if the focus counts. No, it does not. Okay, then five. It's only yeah. five, five, ten. It's not a spell. It's not an ability modifier. It's a magical modifier. So no. Just spell right. casting. And then I'm gonna move back and then <laughs> then I give Karen in a high five. Like, thanks, buddy. I high five back and go back over here. Okay, diamond, it's your turn. All right, my turn. Alright, uh, hit him with one of these. Shit. Unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Okay, will uh, survive. It is restrained. Not sure if I should just, you know, get in front of Mont. Like, no. over here. No. I'm fine. If you okay. have, so if you have ranged shit, you don't can. Worry. Don't worry, I'll protect you, it's just T-Post. No, it, it's too far away, I can't throw anything. Uh, I could probably just prepare and attack the best chance. All right, you know what? I think I'm gonna go and take the dodge action. Okay. And uh, I'm going to, uh, can I prepare throwing shit? You can. <laughs> if it gets closer, because mm -hmm. it's a bonus action. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you. And uh, uh, However, your throwing shit doesn't have a lot of range, so your attack will be at disadvantage. Yeah, I know, but, but until it, it gets also to cannot, range. It cannot move. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not gonna move. No, it oh, cannot wait. move. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what do I do? Don't do much, huh? Bad. Just and... walk up to it menacingly, then yeah. toss it with disadvantage. Oh, wait, how much, how much you're fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right, right, right. Uh, 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 okay. No, it does not, Finny. Okay. All right, fine. Seventy-five. <laughs> okay, uh, I think we're gonna move. To it's it's a here. it's usually it's it's a once per long rest ability. Yeah. I believe. I was just wondering if it took a spell slot as well. Nope. Um, right, well, anyway, uh, I'm moving to here. I don't, and I don't, then, uh, this is about 60 feet from here to here. I'm going to throw it with disadvantage. Uh, that probably anyway. misses, yeah. Likely. It misses anyway. Anyway, I go back. I saw the dodge action. Ready? You okay. Look at him uh, that requires a key point. Use the dodge action. Give yourself 5 temp that? HP, by the way. Uh, action, dodge, bonus Evan. action, shoot, unless oh. you... Do not allow him to and shoot Kensai without weapon action. Makes action. It bonus action. So. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's you it. Have five three. If you haven't done that already. Okay, I'll, I'll figure that out in a second. And then uh, that's my turn. I suggest All we right. do not stick close. Next up is the Dream Raider. Oh no. Anyway, let me see. Take an, take a three damage, sir. You are still restrained, and you have to either make it out or stay there restrained. Huh. Okay. Uh, explain explain uh, what is restraining him. The vines. Okay. It it, it it could be you know flame burn thing. Uh, the creature uh, simply attacks the vines. <laughs> 
and in an instant, the vines burn away to ash. Uh, well, that I was, still have uh... zero movement. <laughs> yep. That is the end of its turn. This is great. Zero. It's your turn. Oh, you had an uh, advantage against uh, it. Nice. There's a text on my screen that's very distracting. I'm going to move. I love it. Hmm. I'm gonna move here. Okay. And I'm gonna pray that this fucking thing hit and she didn't Eldritch Blast at it. Alrighty, roll the hit. That will miss. Oh my fucking gosh. You emanate a bolt of uh, necrotic energy that strikes the creature, however, it, it simply absorbs the blast in its chest. Uh, and then I'm just gonna. Okay, I'm just. I'm, I'm just not. I'm just not lucky, okay. Uh, hmm. what the heck is that? I don't know. Oh, next up, what the heck? Yeah, that's you new. Fancy, fancy vision. Uh, fist, and then you should, uh, don't go too far to my range. Mero, you may oh. want to not. Well, you're go fine, too far, but right? I'm just gonna bless you guys. But it's fine. I'll bless somebody else. Where's the intern thing? You can move up, but you can't. I already did it. I already did it. Zero. Oh. Okay. So um. First things first, I'm gonna peek in the corner and fire my short bow at the creature. Alrighty, roll the hit. That hits. Nice. For eight hit. points of damage. Sneak attack. He does not get sneak attack. He's not hidden. Yeah. I'm hidden oh, yet. that's right. You weren't hidden. Damn it. Yeah. I Damn it, like his. You may want to get out of there. You can hide right now. Yeah, that's well, true. Oh, oh, let me do my thing first. All right, so. I actually want to observe the room. Do I have to do a martial check or something else? Uh, give me a perception check. Okay, what are you trying to perceive? Um, the pillars in particular. Mm-hmm. Oh, I know what he's doing. Huh. I know what he wants to do. <laughs> yes. I don't. What about the What about the pillars? Like, how strong are they? Um, how tall do they go? And it, it would it be enough force of damage with the dynamite I have? Would it be enough to... <laughs> Pop or tip it to the other side. It could. Oh, it could? oh. yeah, it could. I like All this. Right. I like this one. <laughs> All right, then. Then after that, I am going to stealth. All right, you are considered hidden as you hide behind and... this. As you hide behind this pillar. All right, and that is it for my turn. All right, Mon, it's your turn. However, this... before you go. Someone is spectating the battle and will initiate a Dietic Clash between you and the Split Dreamers. A Dietic Clash? Yep, a Dietic Clash. What does that mean? The Lord of Fire is initiating a clash with your gods. Wow, oh, is he? Is there any way I can support him? Yeah, you're, you're gonna roll You're gonna roll a clash against him. Okay, let's go. All right, so <laughs> I need you to roll a 1d20 plus... 1d20 plus 13. Oh. 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 Good shit. Nice. Uh... Plus, it makes me feel good, dude. Plus, it makes me feel good, too. <laughs> hey, what's this one called? Bustin. Bustin. <laughs> hey, I'm halfway through. Can we change it to like a change the song to like Rip and Tear? <laughs> so we just change. Ooh, Undertale. You see ash and uh, ash and fire begin to emanate from the back of the creature as a visage of the Lord of Fire appears. As it says, Make the Empress of the Dreams perish! As its eyes glow with a radiant energy, it rushes forward. Mont, you come in to meet its blow as you whip your chain whip out towards its feet. In the center of your chest, a large diamond begins to glow and emanate with dream energy as you trip the Dream Raider and successfully blast it with dream energy. It's sent flying back, and you get to choose to lock one of its abilities. Oh, man. 
Which one do you guys think? You have the Lord's Claw. Actually, you can't lock that. Molten That's Prison, fine. Feel the Heat, and Magma Spray. Hmm. Either that's Molten easy. Prison or Feel the Heat. Or yeah, get the Heat tonight. Feel, feel the Heat. Don't get rid of him. Let's get rid of his healing. healing. Yeah. Okay. Feel the Heat is sealed. Get to oh, no more healing. <laughs> also, also, all founders. Your Amber Exalt ability is activated again. Oh. As you have found a new benefactor to receive your power from. Oh. Oh. oh man, I still have Amber Bane though, right? Uh, indeed. Oh, Actually, indeed. I need you to roll a d4 for that, um, class. <laughs> oh shit, what? Uh oh. I rolled one. Yes! Okay, good. Uh, you didn't break the threshold to deal damage, but you locked his ability. You have gained your exiled ability back, and it begins to change. However, that will be revealed at a later date, as your ability is under evolution. Okay, cool. Okay, I, oh, I, can't, I shouldn't use it now, but I don't think we'll need to use it now. As okay. the creature stands up, clearly hurt, you look back, defiant. It is your turn. I'll destroy you all. Wait, no. What? Not us in a Not you. Not I'm, pointing, I'm, I'm, fucking at him. I'm fucking at him. I'm pointing at him. <laughs> Me. Fucking the Crimson Phoenix. All right. <laughs> All right, That's um, cool. let's figure out what I want to do. I have lots of options right now. Let's go with, hmm. Ah, let's martial check first, and I get to do it one time at advantage. So let's, let me cast it, please. Roll at advantage. Alt roll? I'll just roll it twice. Okay. 18 is successful. Which ability would you like to learn? Let's learn, um, the Molten Prison. Okay. Attempt to lock a creature within your molten rib cage. They must succeed on a dexterity saving throw. On a failure, they take 2d8 fire damage and are considered stunned. They can choose to make this save at the end of their turn. For each failed save, they take an additional 1d8 fire damage at the start of their turn. That's what I assumed it was. Okay. Let me see. My spells. Alright. Let's go with the bubble. Let's, uh... I have my familiar to control too. Let's see. Uh, first of all, let's get my spiritual weapon bonus action. Anywhere you can put them. It's up to 30 feet. Oh, it's going to miss on the attack. Right, okay. As your, as your blade swings up and hits, your blade appears duller than normal as it begins to take on a different shape. That of the mm. split dreamers. The red energy yeah. begins to slowly turn a dark grayish white. Mm. Fuck right. it shit up, Mon. Let's bless people. I okay. choose. Not cast two spells in turn. Oh, it's not a spell. Oh, it is a spell. <laughs> Alright, total the dead. It is then. Alright, just make a wisdom save. See the big Fails. damage. Takes 12 oh. points of necrotic damage. Good shit. Oh, 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 that's maxed on both somehow. Good shit. Empowerment right now. Good uh, shit. Uh, give yourself a spell slot back. It automatically takes it, I think. Oh, yes. Thank you. I will move. I clicked it twice somehow. I just wanted to update my spells. Okay. Um, let's see. How far am I from it? 40 feet. Uh. I, you know what? I don't know if this is a good idea standing here. Yeah, you should probably come back. It's gonna be right behind the pillar or something. <laughs> well, I don't. I, don't, I have a high AC in the group, so I mean it's fine. On top of back. you have uh, heroism on you guys, so. Yeah. Oh, I had to add the plus ten HP at the five, and then I'm gonna move. Uh, how far can you move? Dash sixty. Hey, Miz. What kind of new animal are you gonna choose for it? You'll see. <laughs> I actually thought a cool no. Can I a dog. Like, can I perception no. with the with the bird to see anything like up here? Uh, can I use the bird's per sure. Okay. Uh, I have to click the bird to do it. Let's see. I have a, does it does it have an advantage? Oh, that's pretty good. You're looking up here. Yeah, I just want to see if anything's up here. Like, you see the th you see the throne is beginning to be ensnared by flames. Your sister lies over here unconscious. The body of Mont lies over here. Almost right in front of you. Okay. 
That's all I'm gonna do. There are also bodies that are in like a state of not in focus, but in focus at the same time, as they're not oh, really important. Uh, fading. Interesting. Should we do something about your body, your sister, or... Like if need be, I can reach her. So I'm trying to get the bird over there. Yeah. It... I mean, this is part of her path, so I don't think anything will really change. Yeah. I should shoot. That misses. I still marked it, but you know. What's wrong, Catboy? Hey, it seems you're you're losing your edge. Are all that sad is affecting you? You have, uh, there is Magma Spray or the Lord's Claws. Lord's. Lord's Claws, okay. Uh, they deal a D6 plus 3 of slashing damage, and on a hit, you may use, you may attack with your other claws a free action. And these claws deal an additional 1D6 fire damage. So D6 piercing, D6 fire. Yep. Uh, D6 slashing. Slashing. That's just how its attack looks like. No, nothing special for being at 21. Uh... Hmm, 21, is that a nat 20? It is. Uh, it is resistant to cold damage. No. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, that Oops. makes sense. <laughs> yeah. No cold, boys. No, that's that's like, that, that's like a portion of my spells. <laughs> I don't wanna, I don't wanna risk the, uh, waste. Okay, Karenin, your turn. <laughs> Alright, uh... I'll go ahead and marshal first. Ooh. To him. Uh, nat 20. The only ability you have left is magma spray. As an action, spray molten magma up into the air and across the battlefield. Roll a d6 for each player on the battlefield. That player must succeed on a dc16 dexterity saving throw. On a failure, they take 2d8 fire damage or half as much on a successful save. Every tile within a 10 foot radius of you is now considered difficult terrain. Moving through this difficult terrain deals an extra 1d4 fire damage to you, and for each round you stay within the difficult terrain, you take an additional 1d4 fire damage. Huh. Every tile is 1d4 fire damage. <laughs> you know, I kind of counter him a little bit. <laughs> Do I get anything with the nat 20? <laughs> uh... It is immune to the frightened condition. Okay. And it is classified uh... as a class 2 boss. All right. I don't know what that means. It means Me it's, it's, it saves it saves are empowered by plus two. Um, oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and hunger. That will hit. She'll touch it for six points of damage. Nice. Damage is damage. <laughs> You're stacking on the can't heal, can't heal button. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, you moved your heal. Now you can't heal twice. Hmm. Be in. Hi, hard. Hi, hi. Eat him. Hi, hi. Eat him. Eat him. What the hell? Uh, <laughs> That's that the one that we made. Get rid of the bad roll. It's randomly generated, bro. You sure you're not drunk? Sad. Nah, I'm not drunk. I've, I've been sober for a good week. <laughs> That's what they all say. <laughs> That's what they all say. They're hiding a stash. <laughs> um, it, it, it just doesn't uh, taste the same, man. Karen's Karen's spells are empowered to its next tier from its uh, from one of his magic items. Can I just throw an unarmed strike in the air so I can get my <laughs> my plus two AC? No, you have to you have to hit. You have to hit. Ah! Uh, can I punch the floor? <laughs> nope. You have to hit a creature. <laughs> oh my! Stop trying to cheese it. Just right. hit it. We need damage. Uh, you just hide? Uh, I don't want to go up I, there. That's fine. She just, hey, just pu punch his mod. Hey, what's too easy? <laughs> uh, uh, can I mm -hmm. can I prepare my regulator hammer when he comes towards us and I can whack him? Yeah. And then you can. Uh, for my bonus action, I'm gonna throw in shit since he's in range. That will hit. Do it again. They will oh, both. Yeah. Uh. Take the lowest. Why do? Yeah. Since oh, it's disadvantage. disadvantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's 10 points of damage. Good job, boom! Throw actual shit on it. As you, as, as, you, as, you pick up, as you pick up a sword that's on a dead body next to you and chuck the sword over. <laughs> Javelin style. It, it, it cleaves into its shoulder. 
and it that begins to nice. burn into its chest. That is not how you're supposed to throw a sword, but you know, I'm not even gonna question that. <laughs> it feels a bit I giant, but anything here works. will be physical. It's your boy's turn. Next turn. Right, how do I even skip? How do I change my turn over? I need Combat. to learn this. Combat. Tracker. Click. Click Button the at the bottom. The dream, the dream Raider begins to lurch back. As it begins to regurgitate magma from its uh, from its chest. All right. One. Magma two, spray. Three. Hidden. Four. It, it's still a battlefield benefit, but it one, it. It's two. Shit. One, two, three, four, five, six. Zero, six. You know, it doesn't it hits it Diamond. Doesn't All right, Diamond, I need you to make a dexterity saving throw for me, please. I'm not three. Yeah, you are. He went one, one two, three. two, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm right. uh, He says you are, you are. Deck saving throw. Okay. Okay, okay. I, be I believe in you, Simon. You can do it. Yeah. Okay, you can do it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it'll be a five. You have heroism, so you have to remember you have that five on you, right? Hey. Oh. Yeah, max, max damage, hey, bro. Mark hey. Ocarina. This is pain. Counter. All right. Oh, and, ten, and, and ten feet from you is considered a difficult terrain. I think I ain't moving. Wouldn't it be this? Good thing uh, I'm No, it's uh, it's it's ten, it's ten feet surrounding diamond. Radius. Yeah, ten feet radius. Uh, you take that every oh, time so you start. Now you oh. take that every time you start that difficult terrain. You take four damage every time you start. And while you're moving through it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll, I'll hey, yeah, the heroes, hey, heroes oh. weeded for me, so. <clears throat> okay, and it's going to move. <sighs> it blocked its heel. Um, that's rough. <laughs> yes! I am a gamer. Uh, and, and he wouldn't have been able to heal this turn anyway. Did a gamer well, he puts the shield on, it's temp heal. Yeah, it was not real healing. Uh -oh. Maybe we locked it, so... Mm. I locked it because I don't like healing. <laughs> Sorry, Amp. <laughs> Gamer's got a game. I mean, aren't we the protagonist? One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven. Who's, who's, the, tr who's the true protagonist? Man, my sword's seven. so fucking far away. All of us. Okay. That is the end of his turn. Zero, it's cool. your turn. Uh, I just want to cast Toll of the Dead. Wisdom saving throw. He succeeds. He succeeds. Hey, I, okay. just, I just suck. As a large a 15 DC. as a large bell begins to toll across the battlefield, it falls under the Dream Raider, but he just simply crushes it with its fist. Yeah, okay. <laughs> God, that scares the shit out of me then next up. I was like, what the hell was that noise? Good question. You can uh, reduce it. It's interface. If, question. If this pillar tilts, would it tilt and hit him? Depends on the direction. <laughs> Similar to like how you cut a log. If you, when you cut it, it falls in the opposite direction. You had to be on this side, or like right here, somewhere to like tilt it towards them. You're trying to get the blow up on him. Yeah, like far towards him. It had to be like a uh, like hey, right, somewhere right, right here. Right here. You had to put it right here. Like right to make here. It here? This no, way. you have to be here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Pretty much okay. there. Yeah. Or here. Or, or right here. Yeah, right there where you are now. Yeah. Okay, so it should be enough that it could. Hit. All right then. So, I pull out one of my sticks of dynamites. I place near the pillar. Um, and I l well, hold on. Do I have anything to light it up with? Actually, nope. You had to call it and you had to use me. <laughs> right, I, I, I can think of something. Okay, so I put the, the dynamite on the pillar there, and then with my two swords, um, my suffer and my short sword, I start like putting them and slashing together to try to make a spark to ignite the dynamite. Hell yeah! You make flame. Oh. As the as the dynamite begins to slowly tick down. Oh, look at the time! I better be, better get out of here. So I'm just gonna five, ten, and fifteen, twenty right here. Iron all. All right. How many rounds will it take for this dynamite to blow up? Three. Okay. okay so I I I yell at um, Lycus. Um, Lycus, can you keep that thing there for three minutes? That that that's three minutes. That's 18 18 seconds. Seconds. 
Well, as long as you can. Can you keep it there as long as you can? Uh, oh, it will go off in three rounds. Oh, it will go off in three rounds. It's not gonna move. Yeah, I, I'm not saying that in three rounds. I'm just saying for the context, like for joking. I don't think I can. No, I don't think I don't think it's gonna move because it's three rounds. Like, is it three of Marrow's rounds or in, in like it's the next? It's three. Round? It's three combat rounds. Oh, so, yeah, so on round, it will detonate. Yeah, on round five. Okay. Oh, so I want to try something. Now that being said, I'll shoot my short bow once again. Miss. Right, and I'm gonna, to the and I'm gonna stealth again. Let's. Ah, oh, nice roll. Uh. Okay. Uh... Um. You wouldn't have been able to attack because lighting the dynamite would have been your action. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Anyway, however, anyway. however, you are you are stealth. Okay. Okay. That's what I thought. It was, it was an action. I do that. Yeah. Cool. Take that. Take, take that one back. We didn't need it anyway. All right, Mont, it's your turn. Bonus action. I can move this 30 feet, right? Mm-hmm. All right, I'm gonna roll its attack without the this use of thing. Do not consume spell slot. Miss. Okay. Um, I'm gonna move out of this terrain. All right, that's a D4 damage. Okay. Two points. Two. All right. So I'm at three. You get five though. temp. Yeah, I already had it, so I, I'm at three temp. I'm at, I'm at three temp. Fuck yeah. All right, I move one. Um, let's see. Let's see. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let's, let's um, bless some people this time. Do it correctly. Diamond one, Lycus one, Ranger one. It's your child. Arigatou. <laughs> Arigatou. Um, I'm normal. just gonna I'm just gonna marshal check to see if I can find anything else like a DC or something. I even roll high. No. Uh, we use um. We use holy holy shield as our concentration thing, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I moved already three, so let's move um. One there. Who's gonna go around the terrain? 20 feet. That's 25 feet I'm of use. Um, I think that's all I can do, right? It's all mm -hmm. my action elements. Oh, bird. Uh, Birdo. Dash. 60 feet. He's right here, right? Okay. okay. That's all I can do, right? Because that's, yeah. that's my bird's action. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. And the turn. So that's one round. Like this round. Hey, it's me. If you add your bless, yeah, I'll, I'll roll your bless so you don't forget. When you attack. Yeah, sure. Unless you want to do it. No, I'm good. You can do it. It's fine. Uh, smack. Miss. Uh, bless. and that will hit. For mm -hmm. 13, 15 points of damage. Uh, 13 plus 4 plus 2. You hunter's mark? Yeah. I said it plus turn. But I didn't hit, so I didn't actually work. <laughs> Uh, Hunter's Mark only applies once. Blah, uh, well, fuck it, whatever. Ooh. Ooh. That's some good shit. It takes 10 base, save for a 2 or 5. Oh, wait, no, it automatically. <laughs> I forget. It automatically fails. You wrote that. <laughs> oh, yeah, it does. I f <laughs> so okay. it takes. Uh... It's 15. Okay. Slot another hour back, and uh, uh, yeah. Hey, Marshall, check nothing. Uh, okay. God, that's so. I got a big ass modifier. Whew. Okay. I'm going to Marshall check it first. I will succeed. I believe you. Damage. <laughs> I believe you have figured out everything. Okay, applied. I believe AC. you have figured out everything. Its AC is 16. Okay. Okay. I, I can. I can. Have cool. That. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and twin spell ray of sickness. All right. Two targets. Oh, I, I forgot. That's how twin spell works. Never mind. Can't twin spell it. Oh. oh. I'll, I'll quick uh, quicken it. All right. Instead. 
Uh, the first attack misses. However, it's going to make a con saving throw. It fails and takes six points of poison damage. Cool. And then I'll go ahead and use uh, magic missile as well. Pew, pew, pew. I'm trying to figure out where the poison is. It does it not have a poison? There we go. I do, I do. And then 12 is... All right. As you pepper, as you pepper it with spells, it falls to one knee. Clearly hurt. You guys have an advantage. Press it. Press right. disadvantage. Oh, Give them and no does the pillar blow up this turn after Cannon's turn? No. And no. that's all I can do. Wait. Three combat yeah. rounds, right? Three combat rounds. Three, three combat, full rounds. Three combat three rounds, not, not so turns. So it goes through all of our turns, and yeah, then that's like one. Three minutes we have to turns, up. we don't have rounds. Oh, that's right. Okay, okay. Because, yeah. That's the that's the that's the drawback with dynamite is that they're not instant explosions. That's right. That's right. Okay. Diamond, it's okay, your turn. Wait, 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 wait. I, uh, you I take <laughs> you take one d four fire damage from standing on a tile. Take two. Actually, that would be three temporary hit points. Yep. Yeah. The end of it. Three temp. Yep. yep. Hang on. Uh, let me you still gotta off. walk out of it. Oh, never mind. You did it. Thank you. Oh, I have to get out of it. Mm -hmm. okay, yes. Well, I have to... uh, I mean, you could stay there and take uh, D4 of damage every turn. <laughs> That's you. You don't have to. I don't want to be but, there. I mean, with he heroism, you wouldn't take any, technically. I mean, I can stand in it. Can I three. call Mama to tell her to get rid of this? <laughs> Why don't you just go, just, you just go oh hit him? God. Open up your water skin, and pour it down. He's poisoned. You know what that means, right? It's yeah. Can I do that? It's great. Should I just go wail on him? <laughs> yeah, I gave you bless, bro. Go beat him up. <laughs> just to charge right, him. Right. If you were to stand there, I would have gave it to Karen. <laughs> I fight for glory, and I want to kill. <laughs> That's all right. Another two damage. So you're down to one uh, temp HP. Okay. Yeah, one temp HP. That My hits. going down. Mm. Oh, because of temp HP. He pointed down. Don't know if I should punch him first so I can get the plus two and then inferior blows or whatnot. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. You don't get oh, advantage on right. it. Punch. That will hit for advantage, four points right? of damage. No. Nope. No, he has disadvantage. You don't mm -hmm. oh, mm -hmm. have advantage. Mm -hmm. Poison is cool <laughs> if it's on them. That's okay. why I have lesser restoration. This is good. So Kill I have plus shit. two AC now and then uh, I guess I'm just going to inferior blows. Alrighty. Go so that's two unarmed strikes, right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Bop, bop. Damn, Both of them miss. Uh. Oh, wait, you gotta roll bless. What is that? Maybe oh, it might not uh, the oh, last, it. the last one could hit. Yeah, let me see. Misses. No. Oh. As you go in, as you go in for two, for two jabs and a stiff upper hook, uh, he, dog, he ducks out of the way and you simply just crack its stone interior. <laughs> uh, I can, uh, so I didn't use my free roll. Can I do a faith check and be like, hey, mama, can you help me? <laughs> Please. Somebody help me. Please help me. Sadly, that does, it does not work that way. No. <laughs> hey, man, you got to work on your own merits sometimes. Stop depending on gods. Yeah, be true. your own person. Pusser. I'm true. just going to <laughs> All right. Is that, is that the end of your turn? He has nothing else. Should I do a marshal check or should I do? Mm, okay. <laughs> do I do? We a know check everything. You can, you can do a marshal check. Bro. You can do First your marshal check, it, man. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay. <laughs> its intention is to eat you. <laughs> Thanks. No, ah. okay, good. But it has this advantage, so who cares? Except if it rolls double crits. Alrighty, as as it as it caught as it catches your fist, it's gonna open up its chest. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw for me, please. Oh God. Ah, you don't have disadvantage if you force the enemy to make saves. <laughs> right. Diamond, uh, dex save. Oh, that succeeds. Oh. <laughs> so <laughs> you will instead take nothing. <laughs> You will take four points of damage. 
<laughs> oh, he was going to on prison, you're at. Round the down. That's the. <laughs> Come on. Come on now. Hey, man. It's, it's, it's HP. <laughs> you gotta add five in your turn, remember? So you remember that? Five temp. I can turn. Yeah. So don't forget about that. I thought it's at the start of each turn. It's at the yeah, start. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's what I'm saying. Don't forget because you'll get like, damage you don't need. <laughs> he has. Yeah. It. Hey, just make it sure. I'm just trying to make sure that my concentration stays up. You're good. As long as he doesn't like hit you with a bolt. <laughs> Imagine one's actually hurting your teammates. <laughs> oh. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Uh -oh. you, get attack, you get you get an A up. That hits nice. for ten points of damage. Oh. That's big damage. Oh there goes my plan for dynamite. <laughs> and I use my ability on it. Probably chasing me down. Okay. Oh, He's gonna heal himself in the fire. I believe it fails. Oh. It's considered non hostile to you. You. It's gonna go over me and now, with these guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he Why? walked away. Oh, no. Panic. Okay. It's the end of his turn. Zero. I'm guessing he's immune to fire. Yeah, he's- yeah, he resisted. I'm me. I'm resisting. Meryl. I get you. <laughs> Throw the dynamite at it. <laughs> I can I actually pick it up and chuck it at him. <laughs> yeah. Question for okay, okay, you could. It might not detonate. You can try to get it stuck on him. Um, Wait, what's, so what's the radius for? Oh, it's plus zero it's talk. instantly that nice because he's made of fire. It was a zero talk. Are you going to throw? Okay. Yeah. Wait, 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 if we throw dynamite that thing, would it actually just ignite right off the bat? And not it's not going to tell us. <laughs> not going to tell you. Okay, like, grab, I'm going to do something. Grab me, dive anyway. and just grab the thing and Let chuck it out of Zero me. talk. Shut up. <laughs> I'm going to do some very dangerous and risky. Oh, gosh. Uh -huh. I'm gonna cast more attacks of blood. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? What? Yeah, I, just, I forgot. Oh, is that your dragon ability? Really? Yeah, it's my new ability. You have to move up. Not close enough. <laughs> you have to move up. Yeah. You have to go one more. There you go. <laughs> 15 foot cone. Yeah, that hits. Alright, he has to make a deck saving throw of DC 12. Succeeds. All right, there so he takes know. two points of damage. Just take two points. That's all. Fuck. As to as me. your eye as your eye begins to um, spray out blood and black ichor that covers the Dream Raider and begins to singe its skin. All right, what are you doing? That was kind of metal, but also disgusting. I like it. Thank you. Okay. Uh I have a question. Mm hmm I'm resistant to fire. Mm-hmm. So I step in it, would I take the damage too? You'll take half damage. Alright, then I'm just gonna go ahead and then we'll you now. Alright. Back. Are you moving up or are you Nah, I'm just gonna stay here. I want him to do something to me. Alright, Meryl, it's your turn. Okay, well that plan failed. Or right, plan B. Okay, I just look at the time and I just Hold one second, sir. <laughs> I'm excited to make it explode. All right, I look at Thymon and just signal him to grab the dynamite that was over there and just chuck it at him when he's when he has the time. Okay, I'll take this. <laughs> you, 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 you signal to Thymon and you get no response. Huggers. No, no, no. Like I shake violently. <laughs> Okay, control. He gives you he gives you that that okay. anime nod. Okay. In the dynamite, would that be a bonus action or a normal action? Throwing it? Not shift. Not shift. Control. Throwing it or igniting yes. it? Throwing, throwing it. it throwing it would be an action. Igniting would be a bonus action? Uh no, igniting it would also be an action. It's already okay. ignited though, this one. The one on the pillar is. Just throw it there. and hope you Not don't the one in his hands. Wait, how far can we move again? You can move like 35 feet, I think. Even more because you're a rogue, something like that. Only if it takes a bonus. What? I won't get affected by this if I move closer, right? What? Wait, but what? If I move close to this thing? 
You're gonna get so, effect. You're gonna get affected by the fire. Yeah. No. Okay. Then I'm gonna shoot my short bow at it. Okay. You have advantage because you're hidden. That's uh also. Oh, that is. That's plus. Oh, oh it's advantage. Okay. I'll, I'll Roll it again if you want to try to get a crit. There you go. All right. That hits for nine points of damage. Okay. Uh, also, okay. sneak attack. Oh, I did not roll. I'm going to add to your sheet now. Okay. No, uh, slash R to D6. Yeah, you can roll oh. it now. Uh, just do slash R 3D6. Slash R. Level 4, it's 2. Slash R 3D6. Oh, I'm stupid. It is 2. Yep. 5 is when it becomes 3D6. Slash R space 2D6. 2D6 or 3D6? 2. 2. For sure. Still good. Hmm. Almost yeah. doubled your damage. Yeah. And then I'm going to. Uh, okay, I'm gonna stealth again. Okay, you are hidden. And actually, can I do any other checks on the area? Uh. Server or anything? Yeah, you can. You can do another okay. perception check. All right. I'll see if there's anything unnatural so that may come to sneak up behind us. Unfortunate. You Never mind then. I'm, I'm, not, I'm just gloating However, my greatness. Oh, you, yeah. you do notice that ashes are beginning to creep across the walls. Guys, um, I don't mean a bear of bad news, but something's there's. Do, do you guys notice the ashes creeping around? Is that curiosity? Or that's just me going crazy? Ashes. Uh, just, just basic load of fire shit. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. Would I need to make an Arcana check on that? Mm -hmm. Or, yep. Okay. Let's beat some people up with the sword. If I can actually land a hit. Gotta find. Great my pen. Roll without spell slot. Damn, man. I'm just getting the worst rolls with this. Same. Fives all day, man. <laughs> Okay. Like us kill it. I'm gonna cast my divinity, Path of oh. Grave. Okay. He is now vulnerable. Um. Would I be able to do like a check, like a kind con yeah. kind of check? Yeah, certainly. Okay. The ash is creeping up and is beginning to envelop the battlefield. Anyone that doesn't have dark vision is going to have disadvantage on their next strike. Ooh. Oh, I, have, oh, I, have, I do. It must be nice to be a cat. It's nice to have true sight. Um, uh, you currently do them? not have true sight because of oh, I don't. your eye is cut. Uh, actually, no, your eye. Never mind. Forget I said that. Okay. 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 Is there anything I can interact with through um, my bird, or do I have to use an action to interact with the uh, spirit? You cannot interact with the spirit because you are technically not present on this battlefield. I'm not present. In the sense that this is a vision of the past, and you cannot change uh, the events of the past. I just want to like look at her. You can look at her. Do I see like her face? She's she, has a, she has a gash that pretty much goes from the top of her forehead all the way down to her neck. Ooh. And she has visible tear marks that are around her face. Miz, can I make a suggestion? You know how in some games there's like, you know, there's like loot or like something behind the throne. Can you go check well, that out? <laughs> that's what I've been trying to do. Well, I was perception checking, but this, all right, can I do a perception bird check then? Sure. Okay. I have dark vision, dark vision of the entire room pretty much. Not very high. You Wait, see, the first would be nice. You see, there is indeed a a pile of treasure behind the chest, behind the throne. Okay. Mine, 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 mine. However. Okay, However, but she, she's not focused on that. You are a part of the vision of the path, uh, of the future, which means you cannot take it. Mm -hmm. It's not yours for the taking. Ah, oh, damn it! So after seeing like her sister and remembering, she'll say, "I'll destroy the Lord of Fire and all of you with it." And then my turn. Oh, I have to add temp HP. Don't forget. Yeah, gotta get your five temp HP. <laughs> like right. it's is your turn. You got. I'll Less. be a bit anticlimactic and use uh, an explodey boy. That will hit. And I comp I compacted everything. 
That's 48 points of damage. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> Damn. He's going down. Good kitty. Gamers! <laughs> Well, might as well go all in with the action shit again. Okay, that will hit for 32 points of damage. No, it doesn't. That's uh, the only ones, I think. That's only one hit. Oh, yeah, it's only one. That'd be too broken. Yeah, I wish. <laughs> yeah, it it doesn't save. save. It, it, it doesn't save. save. It doesn't save. It already got hit by it. <laughs> you gotta remember that. Because this is the second shot, yeah. It auto rolls the. Oh. How does it know that? oh, 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 oh. So it's just. Fail. It's just a six plus five just, is eleven, so he damage. heals. Eight. Five. Huh? Okay. What? Uh, the second shot can't be five. augmented, so it's just a. It's not an explosive arrow. What? It's just just a reaction. You can't use the the, the explosive arrow. Is what he's saying? Yeah. Okay. The the the, the, art, the artillerist bowstring. It it can uh, so it can store arrows, but it can't store arrows that are augmented or special in any way. So it wouldn't be able to augment or be able to store bows that are radiantly empowered or um, other means. It's just normal it's arrows because over time, those magics will become less potent. So that's why it's not designed to keep arrows in long term. You know, it's kind of weird to call it the Artillerist, but I can't store explosive arrows. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you know, I'm just going to marshal take the battlefield. Okay. You get a sense that the ash is essentially ensnaring this prison to take in the Empress of Dreams and Nightmares. Come on. Can you, <laughs> can you fight your own dreams? I'll try. Meow. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, alright. Uh... Come on, I, you, you can do it. Punch him. Do a good one, too. I, I'd, I'd like to uh, Arcana check the battlefield. The Lord of Fire's coming. Oh. Uh oh. All right. Uh, <laughs> All right, then. All right, then. <laughs> I would like to quicken spell Snillox, uh Snowball. Okay. Ooh. Reuse resistance right. to cold. But that could affect it. Fails. So roll me your 3d6 cold damage. Alright, that's five points of damage. It, it, it's resistant to cold. <laughs> what, maybe, uh, you'll yeah. put out the, maybe you'll put out the fire, though. We don't know. Oh, yeah, in the area. Um, <laughs> And then I'd like to... use a... level two... Ray of Sickness. Okay. What the, what's your action economy looking like, man? Crazy. Uh, yeah, he, uh, no. he gets oh. disadvantage. He's still poisoned. Oh, he gets disadvantage on the si no on, on skill checks. Never mind. Skill checks. Oh, uh, I thought that it was skill and ability. So it it still takes it still takes um. Uh... Oh 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 no. Yeah, um, it is ability checks. It's roll, not skill. Roll roll the oh. roll the hit. Roll the hit first. Uh, boop. That hits. Damn. Nice. Roll, uh, roll 3d8 for me. Two. No, it's oh, three because no, it's second level. At a higher level. Ooh. But, but yeah, you, he does but you're take R, an advantage. Your R, Pepega. Yes. Uh, oh, I'm trying take, to do math. Take, six, take 16. It's only poison if it fails. It's full damage otherwise. Yeah, but po he's already poisoned, so it's... Yeah, but it's poison damage, not the poison condition. Why can't I do simple math? Hold on. Um... <laughs> oh, the, the the save is just... The save is poison. Like the yeah. effect of it. The aura. And the damage no, is just... No, the save again. does not have it. No. It doesn't I save. Think it's either you no, the save, you don't the, save, the save is to not get poison. Yeah. 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 So it's that, that's why it doesn't matter. Poison. However, it, it, it succeeds on the. I was calculating the damage. I can't do uh, subtraction. Just, just sixteen, man. <laughs> like, do, do you not have the right click on the token and the? the I do, uh, but I didn't. I didn't. I, I didn't do it. 
Huh. Okay, it's all good. It's good. That, that's just easy things, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, is it the end of your turn, Cannon? Uh, yeah. Diamond, it's your turn. Mm -hmm. So he's un he's not hostile to me. I wonder. That will change when you attack him. Dynamite. That will change when you attack yeah, yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. The dynamite. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Or crash uh, on you. I'm... Ranger, let me hang on. Let me let me let me pull out my plan. <laughs> I was wondering if I can go up to the dynamite, pick it up, and then go up to him since he's non hostile to me. I'd be like, hey, bud, here, have this, and I like shove it into his cavity, his chest cavity. <laughs> Here, hold this. Uh, I might blow your arm off, but... <laughs> yeah, I might. <laughs> also, if you want, like, Mott's attention, you should say it now, if you wanted it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna be waving my arms towards her. So, like, you know, to signify to Mind Link. Oh, okay, so you're trying to get my attention, okay. Mm -hmm. Waving my arms, waving my arms. <laughs> what? Alright, are we connected? <laughs> well, I mean, I, can, you talk, can I talk to him, though? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> waving my arms. No, I'm like, I'm connected to you now. You can talk to me directly. Alright. Uh, you know what? I was thinking about uh, throwing a dynamite into his chest. I don't know if that's a good idea. And if I throw the dynamite, you guys may want to get out of there. Because it might explode. Uh, uh Maybe. <laughs> I, mean, I, I mean, we maybe. should be okay. We're not right next to it. I, that's the thing. Dynamite's really lethal. I don't know how large the radius is. Uh, I guess hold your action for it, maybe. Hmm. Well, look, look. I'm, I I'm, mean... gonna, I'm gonna look at like these two, like they are the closest to it. <laughs> I kind of chuckle scaredly, <laughs> like. <laughs> or should I'll... I just like go in and just wail on them? Desky me. Uh. Yeah. Still mind link. I'm trying to think, like, asking me, like, what you should do. Mm. Uh, I would, I'd find a way to kill it, regardless of what you decide. I don't know. Mm, can I do a... Mm. Do you think I should do a clash? Just to finish it off? You can try. If, mm. you, if you can succeed on it. Alright. Um. Mm. What kind of check can I make right now? Don't forget your uh, 5 temp HP, by the way. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me add that real quick. Let me add that real quick. Thank you. Uh, I don't know if I should just like, you know, go. <laughs> I'm gonna take a step over here, step over here. Uh, I'm going to make a uh, shit a martial check. Okay. See his intentions. Uh, his intentions is to magma spray again. Oh great. Oh no. Anyway. Oh no. Anyway. Uh, I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna take the four, uh, the 1d4 damage. Uh, okay, so two. Three temp HP. Do that. And then I'm gonna get his attention like, Hey bud, how's it going? Uh, sorry to do this, but uh... <laughs> hey, uh, how's it going anyway? Like, what are you guys doing here anyway? What are you doing? It doesn't, it doesn't say anything. Oh. Not hostile, then. Doesn't say anything. Not hostile. Hey, I'm trying to get information oh, yeah, more out of you. You chill? Yeah. Have a kind of good day? I'm just, I'm are just you doing well? <laughs> I'm just, I'm, you doing well, I'm, dude? Meryl's How is that rock diet going for you? I was just looking at this with like one of her eyes twitching. Like she cannot believe this is happening right now. <laughs> Hey guys, Garnet's just confused. You, what, what's that imprint's gonna do? I'm like, I'm Yo, gonna try to distract him a little bit, and then I'm gonna, gonna do the Don't do that. <laughs> Diamond, stop joking around, just kill it. Okay! And then, uh, I'm gonna initiate a clash. Okay. Hey, ask the size of his co- Remember, you get, you get, a, you get, a, you get bless as well, right? Does that, does it work with bless? Bad cat, bad cat. <laughs> Bad cat. If Bluff works, I'll, I'll roll it for him. Alright. Oh. Roll attack. Oh. oh. That's a... <laughs> 23, baby. Oh. Okay, oh. that's a 15. Oh. That's a tier 3 break. Um... Hey, dead. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Damn, Bye. When it really counts? How do you want to do this? Drop. 
I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna be talking to him and be like, yeah, how's your rock guy? Hey, look, look at the Emperor's right there. And then while he's distracted, I just like, BONK! I give him the middle, I give him the middle finger when he, when he looks over at me. Uh. Well, I yell out here, ask the size of its got and it does. Uh. <laughs> Clip him off. You bonk him in the head with your regulator's hammer and with enough force that knocks its head off clean, uh, a clean hit with your hammer. As its head rolls, Right by Mont, it begins to slowly turn to ash, as the as the as it is I would've, defeated. I would have, I would have kicked. It. <laughs> oh. you're, not my, you're not my little pog champ. Steps. <laughs> <laughs> then I nay nay, get wrecked. <laughs> hey man, some people are into that. Watch your words. It's face palm. It was like it's fine. I can't believe that worked. I can't believe that. Actually you have successfully, you have successfully beat the first of five bosses. Yeah. Good job. Good job, Simon. I'm proud. Yeah. You did a little little jiggy dance. <laughs> yeah, beat it up. <laughs> do I see like the refraction of myself? Not uh, refraction. No, you do. The, my corpse just, is just get ready there. for the big boy. He's coming. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, can I do something quickly before something happens? Oh, I moved up. Sorry. You have about a couple of seconds to react. I bolt to turn to get the to, to shut off the, the dynamite to turn it off. Okay, <laughs> you turn off you turn off the dynamite. I go and high five uh, Simon. Hey. <laughs> Where to go? I call my companion back to me. What the hell did you? What was that? Oh, we have a conversation. Have, have a no, spot of no, tea I'm, with I'm, it. I perceive the tone. I mean, you're trying to learn about it, yeah. I th it could. It only gets like speaking grunt. Oh, what's I thought it was. It, it talked initially, and then it started to like grunt like an orc. I remember. I thought it was nice of him to ask how he was before he killed him. I would just. I would just... Yeah, like I. I like, oh, hang on. I, I could have like you. Uh, mm, uh, mm, mm, mm. You know. You know me. Yeah. Mm, uh. I would have just sat him. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> <laughs> I stab Timon. <laughs> Goes down. I would have, you know, I would have stabbed the creature. I wouldn't be having a conversation like we're a bunch of gossip girls in the fucking tavern. Okay. Hey, I'm trying to get information Combat out of it. Is over. At least. As you guys are talking, footsteps begin to follow down the halls this way. Did you get information? Yo, no, you didn't. As a, uh, did you hear that? Oh, do we oh thank look? you. Uh, somebody's there. coming. Are you ready, my bow? With a boomstick arrow. I'm just gonna uh, bolt <laughs> and hide behind the pillar. I'm ready, my regulator's hammer. Go all the way back here. <laughs> yeah, yes. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, wait oh, which wait, oh, that way. Wait, wait, which way the are coming? I'm just gonna go I'm high. pointing frantically. I'm trying. I got my own just flash. No. Oh shit. Oh. And a shogun of flames. Yeah, yeah. I'll, st I'll stick right here. Hey, oh you got God. us a friend. Nice. The two figures begin walking down the road. They. Or, or the the hallway itself they're they're not really or at least they haven't seen to have taken notice of you and they begin to simply just walk down the lord of fire as he walks begins to just begin uh to burn the carpet with his footsteps alone that's a nice carpet you're burning there jesus I, mean, you could have I, think, it's just a, I think it's just a memory shogun grab the empress Oi. i should the shogun Okay. Can I also check? Them? It goes right through him. Uh, memory shit. He picks up the oh, body. Right. Oh wait, guys. Should we marshal check the fire lord? Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Uh, oh wait, no, I gotta. I for a second forgot this is the dream realm, so this is like all the past. Maybe after this, you will finally get your left horn, I. Eh? Yes, my lord. Can I do a marshal check as well? Sure. I want to marshal check him, not him, because he's yeah. a god. You ain't, yeah, hit, you ain't hitting him. I'm checking the Shogun guy. Of course, uh, we now roll like shit. 
I will tell you, with, with your rolls, he appears to be a lot weaker than when you've seen him before. At I'm least follow, I'm gonna follow him. in this state, he is beatable in a fight. Your odds while he is in this state have become a a two out of ten instead of a zero <laughs> or a five. That's this one, decent. he seems a lot more. He seems a lot more manageable. He appears to be a red orc of some kind, wearing traditional Japanese attire. With a long katana that is brandished in flames. Do I recognize him? Roll me a history check. Guidance. Oh. So good for the guidance. guidance. Okay. Oops, I rolled it wrong. <laughs> Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty guidance. good. Pretty good. Pretty good roll. On a 19, he is the Shogun of Flames. He is an outsider from a far off continent and specifically he's notable because he is the only person in existence to have accumulated and formed all 12 weapons of Kering together. Oh, these 12 shit. these 12 weapons are needed to summon the demon lord Izuna. All 12 all 12 all 12 weapons the 12 weapons of Kering K A apostrophe ring uh, all all weapons once formed together can summon the demon lord and is a specifically a very big boon to have. Um, is anyone gonna get Isekai to deal with it after? Uh, and specifically in in the dream realm, Mont, he is the representation of your stoicism and your rigid persona that was baked into your mind through brainwashing. Oh, okay. Stop. Boss, what do we do about the Dream Raider? It should be fine. I sense there are others here. Uh-oh. I sweat. Understood. I need you to make a history check on the Dream Raider. Okay. Take a time. It's like a dinosaur, just don't, I guess. Like, like a dinosaur, just don't move and he will not respond. You would have learned throughout your Crimson Phoenix history that the Dream Raider was, surprise, a creature that was fused together through multiple Crimson Phoenix members to tackle the dream itself. It was an overpowering enemy that managed to beat both of the Empresses of the Dream and the Empress of Nightmares at the same time. Dream Raider. It was created from the late Cinder Knight Apollo. Uh, it, through his vast and horrifying experimentations on people and trying to push the human boundary as much as possible. And we beat it. Crimson Phoenix souls together. I'm just writing this down so I can save it. Okay. The two figures begin walking. I'm gonna follow him. I'm gonna follow as well. He I'm walks. My hands. Just... Don't leave me alone. <laughs> oh, I forgot your child. <laughs> Magnif just, just mag follow. magnificent. Right? Isn't it? I didn't know the shotgun stuttered. <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> Oh, This is so creepy. <laughs> They just kind of stand around. The Lord of Fire is looking at the Empress of Nightmares. Wonderful. With both of those under our control, we should be able to move on to phase three. Phase three. Understood. And after that, kind of turns to the Lord of Fire. I believe you will be stationed here. You have another fight to participate in. Understood. Oh. Mm. Sure. Make me an investigation check. All right. Uh, where is my check? Uh, investigation. Come on, investigation. Hmm. Where's investigation, bro? I'm going to skill checks. Hey, my investigation is supposed to be higher than this. What is this? Jersey. This, the statue is of a dwarven male, clearly adorned in dream knight armor. 
And, uh, Mott, you would specifically know this. This was your right-hand man, your personal dream guard at one point. Um, dream guards are often memorialized through statues. Uh, it's pretty common that, uh, like, they're not their butlers, but their retainers are often idolized as well as the empresses because of their, their devotion to their cause. This one right here, as you could assume, is the retainer of the Empress of Nightmares. Female statue. D does she get a right-hand man or just a left-hand man? Uh, just a right-hand man. Retainer, hmm. retainer of the Nightmares. She is an elven lady and he is a dwarven male. Okay. This is good for elf. Okay. And then I'm gonna check the walls too. Also, okay. my my uh, macro was wrong too. Why? Button. Uh, because uh, what was it? I gained proficiency in investigation and also get deductive intuition because of it. In this investigation. Click it. It's an attribute. Click the button left of investigation. Okay, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Advantage or normal? I forgot. Normal. Okay, normal. I mean. Click the button that's left of investigation. The, Is it? The, the check mark that's not a check mark currently. Click it. There's no check mark. I need to make it a check mark. mark. I'm going to. Uh, give me a second. Go. Kiss me. What <laughs> is this shit? This is out of character. Uh, I, get <laughs> I woke up to comment on it. Kiss him passionately. <laughs> how how did I What are they doing? <laughs> just 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 Karen, just Karen, look away, pretend they're not there, and just <laughs> small wave, just small wave. Do you, do you see this cannon? <laughs> this is in an alternate a... universe. Hey, Karen, do not do not make eye contact with Alright, you'll 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 have to you'll have to roll a D4 with your deductive intuition every time. Or we'll make another martial right. check type thing. He's inside. Oh, inside is wisdom. Mm. You'll, you'll just you'll just have to make another check with it. All right. I fucking hate this, man. I fucking hate it. That's just fine, man. Just, you'll survive. Yeah, I guess. Stop slapping yourself. Why? Why? It's okay, buddy. I will attempt right, to defend the walls. It, I'm, I'm I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, just use this. Okay. What do you guys do as the two? I touch the throne? Sure. You Just touch the touch throne, it. and a pulse of memories begin flooding back, almost overwhelming you. You take your hand off a second as tears begin to stream down your face of a life that you didn't even know you had. You remember, you remember the, you see the upheaval that the dream has felt, the war, the fire, everything. No, I don't give a shit that you were there. <laughs> She's like kind of like covering herself up, like trying to climb, like get rid of her tears. It's like we, we need to stop them. This, this is this is awful. What I, they have what, done. What would you, you see? Well, my memories. I'd, I'd seen. I, I guess I remember this part of the verge, right? Or partially. Are uh, you oh, even this? part of the verge? Well, well, yeah. Well, I don't know. So I'm asking out. So that was the same. Was it hot? Well, that was the same creature that you f that like pretty much beat you to a pulp, and yet we somehow fought it again. Well, I don't think we fought it again. We just fought it. The it, it's kind of stood behind, and we fought it's, its present. I would I would I will tell you out of character that the the Dream Raider is the physical representation of Mod's inner weakness, as you failed oh. to keep the people closest to you safe. When they needed uh, it. Okay. Dream Raider. So all of these, all of these bosses are meant to be a physical manifestation or representation of something within your psyche. Oh, the boss. So the yeah. boss. So what you're to... saying is she now gets stronger. Because is my st the part weakness. of it? My stoic. My stoic. Is the, sh it? the Shogun of Flames represents your stoicism and your rigid persona, that so, was uh, beat into you essentially. Ah, I see. Flames. Some Call of Duty Black really Ops type of really stuff here, bro. <laughs> I know, right? I My you. stoic personality. So, <laughs> so this is pretty much what happened. Oh, go ahead. Alright. 
And then the rock and, was, um... And they begin talking, and it fizzles out of focus. Go ahead. Oh, they just fizzle out? Okay. And the rock, what does the rock represent? Oh, would, that, would I know that? The rock? <laughs> the, the thing we just fought. The monster. Oh, the Dream Raider? Yeah, but that's, was that was that like a different like so you said the shogun was my stoic the, thing that I was the shogun was your stoicism theory. and the dream raider was your inner weakness oh, inner as you weakness. as okay, you kept the failed to, as you failed to keep the people closest to you safe okay, okay. It's, sorry it's not I just, just my brain it's not just, just any bullet and yes. it appears as if the the conversation between the two has died off as one fading memory lasts the lord of fire turns to you Oh, to me directly? Shit. And simply just chuckles before walking off. That bitch. <laughs> Laugh. The, the Shogun Take of Flame. Someone said you a little bitch. Carrying, carrying both... Uh, chaotic, bro. Carrying, carrying both the Empress of the Dreams and Empress of Nightmares off screen. Okay. Ah yes, they go up screen. They, they don't go down here. They go up screen. Like, <laughs> I am fades to black. In anger. Good question. So we know your, what you looked like back then. Who's the other person? Do I remember my sister? I do remember my sister. You remember bits and pieces about her now. I had a sister. You had a sister? She looked good. <laughs> mm. <laughs> of course. You guys twins or something? Yeah, we're the twin I, uh, dreamers. Yeah. You have a good sister, though. That's fucking surprising. Mm. I also have I, another. Oh, do Mont I know? I is I cute I too. I yeah, and she like ignores it. <laughs> that comment. <laughs> <laughs> Although she kind of, she kind of blushes, but you can't really see because she's got like no blood in her face. <laughs> oh, soon there, eh? So, Ooh. if your twin is like that, then you look like this. The Crimson Phoenix really messed you up. Holy crap. And uh, yeah. I look at her nails. Because they're like burnt off. And my whole hand, it's my whole hand, bro. I know. My whole hand. <laughs> and she living a great, wonderful, curious, funny life. You look very sorry, different. I, I, sorry, you look I, very I, different. I, I, That's okay. What do you say? And like, I was just like, oh, sorry, I got sidetracked. Just thinking of money for a second. She like remembers that she didn't look like she. Her sister looked very different to what she looks like. She kind of like, no, to take notes that down. All right, then. Well, that's one thing dealt with. Now, where do we go? There's no more you can perceive about this room. I, like, like, can I try oh, to yes. pray to Weru and we're on to ask for guidance? Your pray, your prayers fall upon deaf ears as slowly, the area is beginning to get broken down as you sense that the next boss fight is coming. Oh, uh -oh the Mets kicking in. Do we just, <laughs> do we just, do we just leave, I guess? And, I you, know, Chief. and you teleport Should back, be? you teleport back to a familiar site. Just okay. you, Mont, for now. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 90%. Also, you all are healed for a long rest. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. I was just about to ask that. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll do that right now. Right. took a lot of damage in this one. It wasn't that scary. We got lucky scary. with my clash. Just gonna say that. <laughs> and you yeah. say we we're gonna die. <laughs> no, no, not that one, maybe. The last one. Ah, you're finally here. Hello. Hello, Shogun. <laughs> he, he stands there just looking at his reflection in the water would you care for tea yeah let's talk wonderful as he begins to brew up a teapot summons little incantations of flames and hands you a small tea uh, a small cup of tea i'll take it are you here to kill me well doesn't have to be that way. Understood. You have the 12 weapons of Karing. I had. Before you I had. split them. Hmm. It's been a long time. I barely hey. remember. 
I gave them to my pupil, a man named Nishi. Ah. Uh, how old well, does he fare? I gave him the left. I gave him the left horn. And I took to the right. Will you get in? Would you get in my way if we try to destroy the, the presence of the Crimson Phoenix in the dream? Sadly, although the Phoenix holds no sway over me, I am bound to do so. I see how it is. Well, is there anything else you have to say to me? I wish you luck, young one. I want to see if you are capable. As he stands she, up. She bows. He bows. He begins to hold the Kering, uh forward. Almost in the sense cutting you in half with his sword. As flames begin to emanate. You hear a demonic laughter that comes from the flames as they begin to emanate off the sword. Alright, and this is how we're going to do this. So instead of this fight being an actual boss fight, what's going to happen here is that we're going to be doing clashes. So it's going to be uh, a roleplay fight. Okay. Fuck yeah, let's go. <laughs> Fucking shit up. I respect him. I, I am assuming you are doing you are doing a magical clash. Correct? I, yes, sir. He looks at my hands. Uh, Does Bless work for this? Uh, Bless has worn off. Yeah, Bless is gone. I mean, if she cast it again, if she can't. Don't know how to he has he has work. the honorable trait, so if you want to do that, that is fine. Give yourself some time to prepare. I will not hold back. Thank you. And I will cast. Uh, so I think I did. I take a wrong uh, long rest first. Yeah, everyone is taking a long rest. Let me just click it and make sure it works. Uh, which one's the long one? Is that the one, the first one, or the second one? Oh, there it is. Let me just rest. I have my heels. Okay, I'm gonna bless myself. Consume spell slot. Okay, so I have plus. So that counter. Well, we'll just say for all intents and purposes that counteracts your malice. Okay, perfect. So you don't need to. Uh, you don't need to roll for that. Disadvantage. Also, okay. I will tell you what happens to your malice because uh, it it is effectively has taken place. Um, so whenever you summon your refraction circle, you summon a life who has been taken because of the amber. Now that your okay. ability has evolved to its second tier, you can summon a character that has been taken from the Amber itself. A fighter uh -oh. by the name of Torold Gerbog, who was in another campaign. Was. Was. I know it is. In another I campaign. Is. I know he, it is. He is a... He takes the place of a level 4 fighter, and he joins combat for one minute upon joining your battle. However, because it is a tier 2 exalt ability, your DC will be increased, and if you fail, you will suffer 2 points of Amber Bane instead of 1. Okay, and I already have 1 point. You cannot use it oh. for this fight. Okay, yes. Okay, you're just telling me, like, okay, for the future I'm just, thing. Okay. I'm just telling you, I'm telling you for the future that you can summon Torald. Awesome. Uh, for this fight. Um, he will have his own custom set of things he can do, and... He will act on his own, on his own initiative, and he will have his own set of actions that he can do because he is his own character and has his own motivations. Okay. He will loosely know about you because of your connections to Salifax. Okay. So, he won't kill would you I, once. Would I know of him? Uh, really know. you will have to ask Salifax about that. Okay. Cool. I you will, will see bit. You will see bits and pieces of his memory, and now that your eye has been activated again, you can speak and interact in the chat as normal. Okay, cool. All right. All right. Are you ready? I'm ready. It's rhythm, like, muted. Going on. No, it's you just slowing, reducing its volume too low. This music is very, very quiet. I have it at like. Oh, it's just really loud. Combat has begun. As there is no respite. Roll your first clash. Okay, so it's one. It is your it is your spell attack. Oh, okay. So just roll like firebolt, right? I'll just do that. Let me just get my character sheet open again. 
Bad first roll. I, I'm opening my every freaking tab. Okay, here we go. Let me get out. Uh, just do a uh, 1d20 plus 1d. Just do that because it's already there. Yeah, just or you could do one d one d twenty plus six, because that makes things okay. easier. All yeah, right, plus six. on a twenty one, you begin to emanate fire around you as you uh, as you summon a firebolt. As the shogun of flames attempts to slash uh, slice you in half, he ducks, and however, gets hit with a firebolt as he skirts back. Very well, good first hit. As he goes in for a second swipe. Again. Yep. Oh. Okay. You're feeling confident as power surges through you that you haven't felt before. The power of the dream is fully at your control as you summon two rocks and crush him in half. As he as he uh, as he cuts through one of the rocks as uh, as and slides to his side. <laughs> I've underestimated you, Empress. I've gotten stronger since last we met. As he cuts an X in the air, as a beam of fire flies over to you. Damn. The two of you, uh, the two of you lock blades as you grab it. The, the the nerves not hurting as much last time and you simply just hit him in the back of the head with your chain whip ah get the cocky ah as he goes in uh, he teleports behind you and goes for a swipe with his katana does he say it <laughs> he has to say it oh fuck However, you anticipate this as you blast him with a beam of radiant energy, sending him flying. <sighs> blast as he, okay, let me see. He activates one of his special abilities. Okay, he's gonna activate Kering's last stand as he moves up to you and instead, he summons 12 versions of his weapon that surrounds him as he's going to make three clashes against your one clash. Okay. Uh oh. This, this, this is gonna, gonna hurt. Go well. nice. Okay, that is one hit. As two swords go into your leg and one uh, s slices across your chest, you take the first blow. I'm not done yet. As he goes in using this momentum to press the advantage. I'm just copy paste this. Oof. You're losing momentum as he pushes forward with his sword, uh, pushing against your chain whip. You begin to lose ground as he as he hits you with the uh, with the end of his blade. Very, very well. Mm. Okay, like there we go. Oh, that's <laughs> that's a reroll. That's a tie. <sighs> oh, that's yes. a ten defense. As uh, as the the friction begins to get a little too intense for you, Mont, you take your you take your grimoire and quickly flow through any quick spell that you have and show him the book as a ray of gray energy surrounds him. He teleports oh. ugh, back to the edge again as you push forward. And tech. Take that knowledge. <laughs> That's bad. I should have let him roll first. Oh. oh, okay. That is a great roll. <laughs> Can't have a guiding Oh, bonus. okay. That's a nat 20. Uh -oh. This had the modifier. Yeah, it's, it's a 27. Um, okay. However, it appears as if that was a ruse as his sword summons shadows of, uh, of a crimson color as he teleports behind you and gets a nice slice at your arm. Uh, your shield falls to the ground and begins to uh, and begins to almost corrode in acidic energy. However, you don't need a shield no more as it's another strike. 
us. Anyway, I started blasting. Jesus, now he's getting crits like crazy. He oh, takes no. his katana and slices it through your chest. As you as you cough out blood onto his face. You have blown off steam too quickly. Charge! You take his advice. Uh, oh no! Yep. Please, please, oh lord! Oh, okay, that's a twenty. Um, okay. as you charge, you attempt to hit with your chain whip. However, your nerves begin to pulse as he cuts your whip by uh, hitting one of the links and simply dis disarms you as your chain whip falls over okay. down to here. Do I, do I, okay. Do I have a choice to like not attack him? Yeah, you have a choice. All right, I'll hold my ground. Confidence. I like that. As he rushes forward. Ugh. Just barely. You lock, you lock blades again. He headbutts you as you, as you skirt back 10 feet. He presses the advantage and hits you with the blunt end of his blade, pushing you under the tree. It does, by the way, Finny. It just, it, it, I had malice. Oh. oh. However, as you were, hit, as you hit the tree, anime style, arms out, you begin to culminate a radiant beam as you fire it. He attempts to cut it in half with his katana. However, it nicks him as you curve it, just barely, as it nicks his shoulder as he falls back. Uh, I will press him. Magic needs. Time! As he attempts to slice you once more. That's how I ah. As you're roll. seemingly running out of energy, he slices you once more. This time, off your armor as more chains begin to fall. Slowly, you're beginning to lose your Crimson Phoenix regalia. Oh. Okay. I'll guard. I'll always attempt to guard it. Oh, yeah. I'll have to attempt to, like, guard myself. Plus six. Yikes. Again, he cuts off the eclair this time, the skull falling to ashes on the ground. Deny your past. He moves back. One I final, One final strike to end this. Roll two attacks for me. Roll a second one. <gasps> mm. Don't mat 20, please. <laughs> ah, come on. Man, you have to say it. Come on, man. Can you spare him so he is bound to you? Uh, I was planning on it. Nice. As you begin to summon another magic another radiant bolt he catches you and cuts the last piece of your armor off however something is there instead uh oh no longer are you shackled by your cinder hollow armor instead lies the plate of the empress of dreams deny your past as he simply backs up, places his katana in the ground, and just gives you a nod of strength. I bow to him. You Both are st you are strong. Now rest. As he simply walks away, blood spurts out of your shoulder, anime style, and you fall to the ground. But you won. I won. You won. I, I mean, yeah, you won. It was a symbol. It was a symbolic victory. Yeah. We both took lots of damage. Meet me. Fun. Meet me again when you're ready. I'll like nod, and because I'm in such pain. As you just thumbs up. <laughs> thumbs up. Bonewick style. It was great sparring with you. 
You're not so bad yourself. Now I, miles. I need to find Nishi. Good luck. Time to kill that bastard. Ooh. Bro. Fuck all, it's fucking awesome, man. <laughs> okay. As the dog finally stops barking. Shut <laughs> The dream dogs are barking. You're ruining the moment, Melon. Stop. It's my, Please. it's my future dog. Please. Please, I beg you. As you successfully win this fight. Uh. And you're teleported to the next arena. But we'll do that next time. Actually, hey. I need to, I need to roll. Which, which verge is this? Oh, okay. First verge. <laughs> Fun. Okay. Mm. So, on session 12, you'll have your next fight against the Fallen Ember. Oh, uh, yeah. Who? The Fallen, fallen Ember. Ember. Thank you so much for coming to the session, guys. As uh, I really appreciate it. It really does mean a lot. And we're going to... End Please, the like Please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. Give me, like give me subs. I'm give poor. him love for his amazing storytelling. Give him some McLovin. I just want to hit a spell, you know. <laughs> I'll give you bless next time. <laughs> I don't think just go now. We're gonna, we're gonna go hey. raid. We're gonna go raid someone. Hey, can I say something? Please bear with me. Yeah, you're still live. Ask, ask the question. Oh, okay, okay. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, first off, nothing bad happened to the founders. Woo! It was a close end. I'm not gonna lie. Also, that, that cool. also two. Can we get a battle statistics from the DM? <laughs> What's up? But yeah, okay, what? I did. Okay, you just want to call me out, huh? I did no damage. Okay. Do you want no. to say I did the most damage? I mean, I did I like say it I did like twelve damage, but that I was did fine. less than that. I'm pretty sure. Oh my attack! I'm, I marshaled the heck out of him. Hell yeah. <laughs> that clash in the beginning though, bro. Damn. I got lucky. My plan would have worked, but unfortunately, it had to, it had to move. Well, we, if we it prepared for it, and like you said, shoot, we would have had some time. <laughs> All right. We're going to go, we're going to go raid them. Come join us next Sunday where we fight the next couple of bosses. And then and Wednesday. Wednesday. We will come join us Wednesday where we also fight another boss, and then Thursday where we fight another boss. It's boss week. It's boss, it's boss, boss, boss time. Week, guys. Um, yeah, we, thank you so much. I appreciate you all. We'll see you guys next week. No, we appreciate you. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>